The Minister of Transportation, Mr. Utimi Amechi, says the freight services on Wari Takwe Standard Gauge Railway Line will create more jobs and promote the ease of doing business in Nigeria. Amechi said this during the inauguration of the freight service of Standard Gauge Railway Line in Ujevu community near Wari Delta State. You need to cooperate with the federal government. You need to cooperate even with the oil companies. I'm not, as a South South person, I'm not here to struggle for uh, if you don't give us this, you won't do this. Even the federal government project, even federal government project, and it creates job. Half of those who will be employed here, or 90% of those who will be employed here, will come from this village. The chairman governing board of the Nigerian Railway Corporation, Al Haji Ibrahim Musa, spoke on the rail construction and design. The Lagos to Calabar coastal line and Kano to Maradi standard gate railway line projects are in view for financing and commencement. This standard and rail lines, when properly integrated with other modes of transport, will provide efficient services for high density flow of passengers and cargo traffic over relatively long distances, including high volumes of con containerized cargo or bulk freight, such as steel, agricultural produce oil or related customized cargo as we are flagging up today. Managing Director of Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation, Mala Mele Kiari, represented by the Managing Director, Nigerian Gas Company, spoke on the many benefits of the project. To as low as reasonably possible while delivering on the project on quality and time. Moving pipes through Nigeria roads was the only option at the beginning of uh, the project. Uh, when we started to haul pipes uh, towards the end of 2020. Uh, but with the commissioning of the rail line, uh, it gives us the opportunity uh, to leverage on this very important uh, infrastructure, uh, which has consideration of safety of people and assets. And the rail option indeed has been identified as a cheaper, safer, and fastest means to deliver these our uh, line pipes from the ports in Wari to project sites in Aja Okuta and Kaduna. Governor Ifayo Kowa of Delta, represented by his Commissioner for Transportation, assured the state government would protect the equipment. I want to assure you that everything that is here today will be highly protected by the community and by the local government and all the towns. Because we see it as something that will bring development, something that will change the landscape, will change the economy of this area and the economy of that state.